So here it is, our home gym. Welcome back to another video guys. Today I want to show you how to take out your home gym with less than $100. Yes, you heard me right. A full gym, you can work out every single muscle group with the equipment we're gonna buy today. Trust me, I've been there where you don't have access to a gym or you don't have the money to buy the high-end equipment. But let's, let's be honest, all you have to do is be creative and that's what I did for you guys. So all you have to do is watch this video save up $100 and then you have a full on gym at home. Number one, we need to get a U-Haul. You got a truck right there. That's the one that I want. I'm gonna get that real quick and then we continue. We have to do this incognito because they don't like it when you film here. Even though it's the best place to shop for a home gym. Let's get started. Step number one, we need a barbell. And right here, this is the perfect aisle. It's Bay 19, aisle 26. Um, they have different barbells over here, like thick ones, uh, thinner ones, heavy ones. I personally prefer this one right here. First of all, it's stylish because it's black. Perfect height. And now, with this one, you can basically do everything you want, like bicep curls, right, triceps, back squats, shoulder press, deadlifts, rows, everything. So, barbell for, which one is that one? I think that's the 1565. So 15, let's just say $16 with taxes or 17. Done. The next step, we need weights and um, Honestly, Home Depot has the cheapest weights possible. We can get 40 pounds for around $7, follow me. And how convenient, the weights are exactly across from the barbells. So right here, we have um, 40 pounds of salt right here for seven dollars so it's 40 pounds seven dollars it's in a great packaging so you can do farmers walks with it um very durable of you know packaging this up here it looks you know weak but it's not like i had this for i don't know at least a month and i did like farmers walk and stuff and it's still in perfect condition so we're gonna probably what do you think alum is two or four i want to do two of those because we could do deadlifts later and then maybe if there's another weight, is there maybe a twenty? Yeah, 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 yeah. Home Depot has a lot of different weights. Okay. So this is seven. Ooh, seven dollars. I want to lose our bottle. Yeah, seven dollars again. Another seven dollars, and we have eighty pounds already. Eighty pounds of weights for fourteen dollars. Insane, guys. Insane. Like I mentioned earlier, Home Depot has a great variety of uh, different barbells. Uh, I'll let me show them real quick. So you have like really big ones up there as well. And if you want to have your gym more of like an earthy vibe, you have wooden ones as well. I personally would not recommend these because you can easily get a splinter in your back if you do back squats or like shoulder presses. Um, and the maintenance for these is, is a lot. Hello. Yeah. All right guys, if you need um, a pad for your barbell because you are sensitive on your back and you're like, ah, you know, like the barbell hurts, no problem. They have padding here as well. You just use that, bring it around here and you have a perfect padding. Since it's not an essential, we're not gonna get it, but it's fairly cheap, $2.63. Do you think it's in the budget, Automus? It is, but we don't need that stuff. But still, I want to like show people, you know, to get okay. like a gym. So okay. let's just do it for now. <laughs> if it's if it's above a hundred dollars, we're gonna take it back. So we need um, buckets as well because we need some additional weight for uh, very specific, you know, exercises. And um, yeah, let's just let's do this. Last but not least, we need a bench, of course. I want to just show you one. If your budget allows it, you can um, get one of these. These are pretty amazing. Because now you have, you can do your curls, your presses. You can do your bench press right here. But the only issue with this one is you don't have a, um, a rack, right? So you need to make sure that you can lift the weight up first. 
And on top of that, it's like $50 at the moment, which is not in our budget. That's why we're going to go with these two babies, um, $10 each. Um, and it will be easier for us to do bench press. Okay, never mind. With taxes, $65. All right, let's do this. So here it is. Our home gym. Okay, I'm more than excited to go home now and actually do a workout, show you every single exercise that's possible with this home gym right here for less than $70. What was it, $65? Mm -hmm. $65, every single exercise you can imagine. Yeah. Yep. Looks good. What so, do you think? Why did we get a truck? What do you mean? Like, it's a gym. It's perfect. It's, it's just, just. <sighs> oh no. Just, just a little bit. Good to go. Nice. Alright guys, this is our home gym. I know it doesn't look like much, but trust me, you can do almost every single exercise there is. So how about we start assembling our barbell? Um, like I mentioned earlier, we've got the protection as well, just in case someone's like, hey, my neck is sensitive, you know, my back is sensitive, I wanna make sure that this doesn't hurt my body. So this is what we're gonna do first. Have you seen the box cutter? Okay, we'll be right back. And here we are again with the box cutter. So what we wanna do first is we wanna measure it for the box. So this is probably where I need to cut it. Boom, get rid of this. And now, oh, by the way, do not, you know, take that off, the yellow one, because it's a sticky one. So as soon as you do that, it's gonna be, you know, glued on forever. So what we're gonna do is, put that on here. Let's do that real quick. Boom, and we're good to go. So this is number one. Barbell is ready and it feels good. Feels really good. I like it. Okay, so this is number one. Um, now next step, I wanna make sure that I have um, like an area right here where I know exactly that the weight won't move a lot because we will attach the uh, buckets and the Morton salt as well. So, what I want to do is, I'm going to use this and make sure that it's not going to slide too much. We'll probably do a jump cut too when it's done because this will take me a little bit. I've got the time to show my love what it's all about. That in itself, um, creating the barbell, um, is a forearm training. Just doing this for, I don't know, five minutes straight is exhausting. But anyway, so we have here, uh, our barbell is ready and I think we can start actually doing the first workout. Okay, so this is the first exercise, the benches. Each bench uh, holds up to 300 pounds. I'm 180, so I should be good. Let me move down a little bit more. There we go. And now we're gonna start with the first exercise, bench press. One, two. So this feels way heavier than a regular uh, 135, you know, warm-up set. But yeah, as you guys can see, perfect, perfect height with the bench. The only thing I might want to adjust is move this down a little bit so I can actually, let me just keep it on. Yeah, this is better not. My head rests on the bench and I have all my weight on my butt on this one and all the pressure is gonna go right through me into that bench and my head is completely relaxed. Let's just try one more. So, I'm gonna make sure that the weight is right in between my two beautiful blue lines and here we go. Uh, yep, that feels good. Okay, and. Oh, 
Okay, the next couple of clips gonna be um, just me showing you exercises. It's not like a full workout, but I wanna make sure that you understand that with this baby setup, you can basically hit every single muscle group. for under $65 from Home Depot. Um, the buckets, I love them because you can add up to like 35 pounds to a workout. Over here, the 45 is pretty, you know, it's, it's done, it's sealed, and it's, it's pretty sturdy, so um, they don't break easily. So unless you like really drop uh, the salt, you will be good for a very long time. And if it breaks, you lost $6, you know what I mean? Also the bar, the bar is super easy. Um, all you gotta do is tape a little bit so the buckets or the salt won't slip and you're good to go. You can use this bar for warm-ups as well. You can even do like a shoulder front raise right here. Um, yeah, pretty easy. The bench is right here. I didn't even show all the exercises. You can actually use it as a step stool for, you know, like a, a cardio workout as well. But I just wanted to prove to you guys that there are no excuses. If you say you don't have money, not a problem. Just save up $65 and whenever you have that, get that and you have a full on gym in your backyard, in the garage, um, you know, wherever you find space, even in an apartment. I mean, it doesn't look nice, but you know, you get the point. So yeah, that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for tuning in. If you haven't subscribed yet, please click the subscribe button, hit the notification button. Um, and yeah, leave a comment as well. Hit the like button. I'll see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. Pow! <laughs> that was the weakest. <laughs> <laughs> I've got to die.